Okay, you okay up there? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Here, catch this thing. Oh, jeez, that was close. Great, you're not dead. Listen, Pete. I know you think you can't do this without me, but I can't help you no more. I can't save everyone. I mean it this time, man. When we get out of here. I'm out. I need you to respect that. Please. You shouldn't be alone right now. We can help you through this. You can't force me to stay. I ain't trading one cage for another. Between being alone and being dead, I choose alone. Here, let's just blow this up and be done with it. All right, I get it. Let's just do this, okay? Better back up. Time, Time to, to make, make some donuts. pebbles out of these big boys. What the hell are you doing? Uh... Hey, I came up with the plan. I get to blast the stones. Not to mention crawling into those disgusting holes. If anyone gets to do it, it's me. Rocket. I'm saying the cool thing and making everything explode. Excuse me? What do you think I would... Every time I think you run out of jerk, you dig deep within yourself and pull it from somewhere new. It's impressive, really. Hey, you know what? If you need it, take it. Thank you. Sorry, Paul. It was either gonna be you or us. Yeah, it could have exploded more. Whatever, man. That was cool. long are these freaking tunnels? We get it, we're in a cave. Almost. Oh, come on, Pete. You farted. I know it was you. I got excellent smell receptors. 1,000% sure it was the worm. I think your percentage is a little high. Can we just keep moving, please? The end of the tunnel's just up ahead.
Hold on. We're here. Almost there. You would come with us. Everyone stay quiet. I'll get tracks. Wakey, wakey, big guy. Time to get up before the worms do. Enough awkward hugging for today. No. Seriously, Trax, get off me! I will help you. No, no, not you, Mantis. No. Something small. Still fresh. Must be close. Show yourself, and I will be merciful in how I kill you. you, Papa. You should have seen your face. Outwitted by your own daughter. <laughs> yes, Kamaria. You surprised me. I knew I could do it. You are getting stealthier. You have now completed the test of guile and diversion. These skills will serve you well on the warrior's path, where every child... Must leave their home and make the perilous journey to the training grounds. Take it seriously, Kamaria. I say it out of love, daughter. This path, it is not to be taken lightly. If... If I was scared, that would be all right, wouldn't it? Not that I am. It's just that... I mean... You must be strong, Kamaria. Push your fear away. It will not help you in battle. Yes, Papa. I will be strong for you. We don't have long. Before you leave, I promised you... The tattoo! I am ready, Papa. <laughs> I know you are. Your first tattoo marks you as a warrior in training. You will add many as your journey continues. Relax, daughter. It will not take long.
Mount Kylos. Your mother and I had our soul union there. I don't ever want a soul union. Never. Ever. I will become a great warrior on my own. I'm not like the other scouts. Talking as if they're already warriors. They are far too childish for me. Standing with others makes you stronger. There is much you can gain by having someone at your side. Like you and Mama. Yes. She is much tougher than you. <clears throat> you are doing very well. I remember my first, and how much it hurt. Papa, there's so little time, and sometimes I feel like there's still so much to ask you. What is it you wish to know? What if... What if I face an opponent who cannot be beaten? I am strong, but I am small. If that happens, you only have to come and find me. Nothing is unbeatable when we fight together. And what if... <clears throat> what will you do if I return more powerful than even you? My legend spreading across the valleys. My foes quivering in fear. Then we will have to fight each other. And that will be the day of your greatest defeat. Ow! It is done. It is us. There is one last test you must pass before you can leave. Conquering the unknown. It's too far. I, I can't see what's down there. You must jump. Unless you wish to wait another year. No! I'm ready! Like you said, fear won't help me. I can't do it. You have to help me, Papa. Wait! I just need a second to gather my courage. I can do this. <gasps> you are not ready. At least I get to spend another season with you, even though I let you down. That is not possible. I am proud of you no matter what you do. Thank you, Papa. I will be stronger for you. Papa, we should go home now. You have to let me go sometime. You can't hold on to me forever. I get it. You're gonna miss me when I'm gone. Okay, okay. I will miss you too, and Mama. We can't wait around all day like this. It'll be dark soon. I'll fight my way out of it if I have to.
never should have let her go. Maybe... Maybe then she would still be alive. Drax, I... Hey, that's real sad and all, but we can use some muscle over here! This is where we run. For this. Then I will be fast. I'm sorry. I promised I wouldn't make you relive someone else's memory without your permission. Whew. Okay, we can go now. The ship! There's my girl! Hurry, Rocket! I'm trying! I ain't got long step legs like the rest of you! Everyone take a seat, we're leaving! Did any of you get a good look at that thing? <laughs> what was that even? I am Groot. A tree? Stop yanking my tail! It's giant and terrifying and probably wants us dead. I don't need to know any more about it. In this case, I'll say your extreme lack of curiosity is a virtue, Will. Nebula's plugged into the ship. She's stable. Okay, then we're good to go. Wait! I feel something. Someone is starving. No, bigger! My hunger has no equal. Ah. Once we're out of here, we'll get you some food. That is one big bowie. I am blue. Wrong again, Blue. We're all gonna die. Hundred feet! Today! Everyone, hold on! Are we dead? Uh, not quite. We're lunch! Or dinner. What time is it? This slimy cave. It is... A big ol' stomach. Nebula. Look at her. What the hell is she doing? Mora, wait! Damn it! Plug her back in, Peter. No. Stop. Please. If your systems shut down, we can power them through the ship. They won't do anything. Stop being so stubborn. It can help keep you alive. I don't like... being tethered. No. I'm past that point. Don't be stupid. Please. Don't make me beg. He's trying to help, Nebula. We can't do anything on our own. I'll get Rocket. There's no use. Can't be put back together. This time. Honestly, it feels good to have parts of me. Despair. 
wish I could have done this whenever I wanted. Thank you. For helping us back there. You risked yourself for all of us. <sighs> and look where it got me. <laughs> At least, Gamora's is okay. It was my idea to put all this in my body. <laughs> Told everyone it was so I could be better than Gamora. Why did you really do it? To be more like her. I looked up to her. I was terrible to her. I loved her. You should tell her exactly how you feel. You have no idea how happy that would make her. You think so? Horny, but it's never too late to make things right. You can always make a change. Yeah. Maybe you're right. Thank you, Peter, for listening to us. <laughs> Whatever it is, I'll tell her what you said. I've been afraid of how she might react for so long, but... I'm already dying. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Hey. Hey. Do, uh... Do you want me to... I don't know people... <laughs> trying to fix me. I, uh... Yeah, I get that. There's something I need to tell you, sister. What is it? I... I love you. can sense your despair, Peter. Everyone's really. Is Nebula still? I don't mean to pile it on, but I got some bad news too. Our engines got thrashed when we were swallowed. Can we still fly this thing? Not a friggin' chance. Okay. Let's get back to work. just want to focus on
In the end, she was one of us. A guardian. I think she liked it. Being part of something good for once. Nebula was the fiercest, most sinister opponent I have faced in battle. What I liked most about Neb was how much she hated Pete. Like in a deep, unrelenting way. Funny girl. I am Groot. Oh yeah. And she really seemed to care about you, Gamora. You should value the connection you two shared. To be alone is a worse fate. Speaking of worse fates, we gotta figure a way out of here before we end up like those poor bastards. Those poor bastards. Exactly! Huh? What? Look at all those ships. There has to be some parts we can salvage out there. You forget about that internal ocean of stomach acid. You can't just take a little swim. Then get me flying again. I'll see what I can do. I mean, I sure ain't dumb enough to go out there. some engines. That'll do. Listen, I've been running the numbers. We gotta drop weight in order to take off. Drop weight? How exactly do we do that? Yeah, take everything that ain't bolted down and give it the old Chucky Chuck. The lighter we are, the longer we float. The easier it'll be to get airborne. Desperate times, right? When aren't they? Ah! Oh, please don't tell me this. Well, they didn't burst into flames. So time for round two. As I don't overwork the jets, I should be able to avoid the acid. I hope. Hey, Rocket. I want you to go easy on Gamora. Okay, she's... Yeah, okay. I know when to back off. Drax, how's the unloading going? I keep tearing objects off of the bridge, but Rocket says they are essential to life support. Yeah, um... Why don't you check with him next time? Drax. Yes, Peter Quill. Have you gathered the necessary components to eject us from this beast? Not yet. What about now? on how to move these engines, my boots won't be able to. It's an engine, Pete. Just turn it on. Oh, good. A giant red button. This always ends well. Just had to put in some elbow grease. Sounds gross now that I think about it. Careful, Quill! Hey, I'm doing my best out here. Great! 
Now I'm inside an upset stomach. There's a rhythm to it. Yes, Drax? I think we should dispose of that. No, Drax, she stays with us. But it hardly makes any. No, Drax. Rocket, what's up with these boots? I thought you fixed them. I made a valiant effort. There's only so much you can do when parts are scarce. Incidentally, we're gonna need to replace our plumbing when we get back to nowhere. Either way, stop complaining. Moratorium. Ugh. That'll give you indigestion. This old stomach is lined with thorium crystals. Like the acid wasn't bad enough already. Nah. No engines here. Rocket. Any luck lightening the ship? Gamora says if I go anywhere near her room, she'll cut off my head. It's a work in progress. How's the rest of the crew doing? We are arguing about what to jettison. Get back as quickly as you can. inside an upset stomach. There's a rhythm to it. Yes, Drax? I think we should dispose of that. No, Drax, she stays with us. But it hardly makes any... No, Drax! Moratorium. Ugh. That'll give you indigestion. Talk some sense into him. I'll see what I can do. 